Hi, this is Sadek from TutFirst.com. This is a video series for you about PHP session. In my first video, I talked about basic PHP session. Now I will talk about session hijacking. What happens when a hijacker get access to your session IDs? So I will show you uh, this in this tutorial. Okay, let's get started. Let's take two files. Let's assume we will be using login.php. Though it's not a real login now it gets a protected page called profile.php which is only meant for the authenticated users now in login.php page just assume that the user is logged in okay uh, need to start the session session logged in equals true okay you are logged in okay and in profile.php page now let's run an if condition as you know whenever you work with a session you need to start it first session start and now run an if condition if is set session is log maybe it is logged in let me see it be sure the spinning is correct okay and then Equal, equal true then we can simply call that welcome to your profile else we can assume that the user is not logged in simply echo you are not logged in okay what you can do here is simply just redirect to the users to a 404 page 404.php page okay now first i will run login.php page and then i will visit the profile.php page let me show you login login.php okay i'm now logged in now if i visit to Sorry, it will be profile.php page. Profile.php page. Okay. Welcome to your profile, which means I'm now logged in. Now I'm I will I'm going to access this page directly without logging first, right? From my crew of Firefox browser. So what I'm what I'm doing here, I'm just simply trying to access the profile.php page without getting authenticated first so let me show you you are not logged in right so in this case uh, the system is checking whether my logged in uh, uh, index is true or not and then showing me uh, this block of code right so what hackers do here hackers try to steal this session id uh, which one okay this one is let me remove this one okay this one was generated from the google chrome and this one was generated from the uh, firefox and as you can see that there is nothing okay now i will try to show you how hacker can steal your session ids so hacker can try to steal it using javascript and um, there are different method to steal your session ids they can just case it or they can just brute force it in order to access your session ids all you, all they need is your session ids right okay but before going to do that now let me show you one important thing one important thing application then go to cookie cookie now 
look at that PSP session ID and the value of it is URET2 and the domain is localhost path is slash which means that all the URLs in this domain and session expiry date and now look at that HTTP is nothing secure is nothing and what is this one okay I'm not getting what is this one now let me show you beautiful equal document dot cookie alert eh? okay. I ran it in login dot php please look at that I have got the session ID exactly the same session ID you are e2 to right and this session ID is present right here right so if the hacker can run or get access to your uh, file somehow and can get in the uh, can inject this JavaScript code they can simply get the session IDs right so currently our session IDs is, is uh, accessible via the JavaScript code right so we need to protect it so I will talk about how you can secure your session IDs in my later video but let me show you uh, the exact same uh, IDs can be accessed via the JavaScript code or also can be a boot force or can be uh, guessed though it is really hard to guess this value but let's assume that the hacker uh, get got access to these IDs right so what will happen if they simply get your IDs they uh, what will uh, what they will do now let me show you shift and F2 let's open the console and just type cookie list I will get a list of cookies here and look at that PSP shash ID is SDSD now let's edit it and simply paste the real IDs here okay now what I have done here what I have done is that I am getting the session IDs and you can assume that I, uh, I have stolen this uh, ID and now assigning this ID in my browser now if I try to access this page I will get access to it you are welcome to your profile right so I simply just um, got access to this page which is not really a good idea so in my later video I will talk how you can secure this page and use uh, the user station IDs securely so thank you for watching uh, this video please like subscribe and comment your available feedback